Hey, Dave with Forever Learning. Have you been seeing all these personalized avatars on Facebook and wondered how they do it? Well, today we're going to show you how. Also, towards the end of this video, I'll show you where you can find step-by-step -step instructions with links back to this video to do each step. But let's go ahead and go through it right now. All right, so the first thing you want to do is open up Facebook. This does need to be done on your phone. Both uh, iPhone and Android can do this. It cannot be done on the website at this moment, so you must do it from a... Uh, a handheld device. Uh, I believe an iPad can do it as well. So, so open up Facebook on your phone. If you go down to the lower right hand corner you're going to see those three lines. Select them and scroll down to the bottom where it says see more. Select that and right there you'll find avatars. Select avatars and you click next to get started. And then click get started. First thing to do is select your skin tone. So select your skin tone and tap next. I think that looks like me. So this is what I'm going to look like when I'm really old with no hair. Now you're going to go through and select your hairstyle. That's probably closest. Next link over, so hairstyle is the left. Next one over is going to be your color, so I can select the color of my hair. I'm blonde, so let's see what works best for me. I think uh, this one here looks pretty good. Now we're going to look at the uh, shape of my face. My jaw is not that wide. I think that's pretty good. Next one we have is for skin complexion. I don't really have any freckles, but let's see what some of these other ones do. Yep, so freckles, more freckles, lighter freckles. I think I'm kind of devoid, so we'll leave that go for complexion. You can put a beauty mark there if you wanted it. If I don't have a beauty mark, I'm not that pretty. All right, so next we're going to go ahead and switch over to uh, any lines or wrinkles on your face. I'm going to try to keep myself looking young, so I think I'm going to skip that. All right, next we've got our eyes. It's the shape of our eyes. So obviously left to right, you can see it's kind of like a smaller or more narrow eye to a medium size to a wide size. I imagine I'm more in the medium category. I still like that one the best. I think I'm going to stick with that for now. And eye color. Eyes change, but mostly blue, blue to hazel. I'm going to stick with the blue. I'm somewhere between these two, but I'm going to stick with what I got here, blue. Makeup. I'm not putting on any makeup, so we're going to skip that section. Eyebrows. Mine are usually pretty full. I pull out the sections in the middle, so I think what I have there looks pretty good. I'm going to let it go. And the color of my eyebrows should match my hair, I imagine. Definitely not this, but if you had green eyebrows, there it is. <laughs> that looks pretty good. Do I wear glasses? I don't. I am to see my phone, but I don't have any glasses on. And uh, they don't have colors for your glasses yet, but I guess that's coming to add... Uh, Right, to see color options, I see what happened. I didn't have any glasses selected, so therefore I couldn't select a color for them. That's why it didn't work, so forget that. I'm skipping over that. Let's change my nose. What kind of nose do you want to have? I think that is my nose, which I already have picked for me. iPhone knows more than we think, don't they? And my lip shape. At the end of this video, I'll put a picture of myself here so you can see how I did and uh, comment whether you think you uh, whether you think I matched it up or not. That looks pretty good. No lipstick. I can skip the lipstick color. No facial hair for me. No colors available because I didn't select any facial hair. There's my body. That's the dream body right there. 
I'm kind of in this section right now, I think. A little bit heavier than I'd like to be. I think that works. And what kind of clothes I want to put on today? I'm usually just wearing jeans. Let's see what we have. So apparently they want you to wear flannel shirts if you wear jeans. I like what I got. I'm going to stick with the uh, default. Uh, no headgear, so I'm going to skip over that. No color for the headgear, and that is it. When you're happy with you have the avatar the way you want it, just click on the upper right-hand corner on the check mark. This is your new avatar. Once it's done uploading there at the bottom of the screen, hit next. And click done. Done again. Finish. There you have it. There's your custom avatar. You can change what he's doing, select poses, share him on Facebook. So I hope this helped out. As always, feel free to comment down below. If you'd like to see more from us, make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring the little bell to see our latest videos. Thanks for coming out today. Remember, we are all forever learning. Mm -hmm.